12 months ago, Forest Green, the Rovers and MK Dons were chasing promotion. Fast forward forward to the here and now, and it's relegation on the forefront of the minds of both clubs. Rovers bottom and finding wins hard to come by in League One. Dons' last win was on Boxing Day against Forest Green Rovers. Oh, sunshine, crowd inside. Green manager Ian Birch not looking for that win to help propel his side up towards the safety of mid table. Oh, Joe Keith is going to take Gets it back as well. Corey O'Keefe back to Cooper. Casey. Oh, that was a poor pass. Okay, Dons to get forward. It's a wrestle forward for Will Grigg, but he couldn't really to mind an opportunity once he got to the penalty area. One against one situation. It was fairly strong defending in the end from Cooper to deny Grigg. Penalty area, and was there a foul? It didn't matter if he could just put it away, and he does. And Pitt Harris gives Forrest Green the lead. Back at Yoko, so close to scoring on his debut, but he'll take an assist from it. And Miles Pitt Harris, on loan from Brentford, applied the final touch. It's hardly going to go down as goal of the season. But it might just be one of the more valuable goals this season for Forest Green Rovers. Could it spark a revival? MK Dons won the Boxing Day fixture between these two. And a single goal to nil. It's going the opposite way this time. Watson. Hand sight. Cole was on his way. Intervening was Cooper. Corner. Taken short to McKechnie. McKechnie again. Had to deliver it. The edge of the box. Back in again. No oh, one really there. Let's go behind for a corner. Bided the time with the. Corner to MK Dons. Behind by Casey. Chester taken tidily by it. That's a good ball in. Just needed a runner to come in and cause the, the goalkeeper a problem, but it was straight through to Doohan. Easy save in the end for Ross Doohan, who recently arrived from Tranmere Rovers. You can spell MK Dunce, it's falling behind. Harvey. Right to the right hand side. It's across from Watson. Deep one, Marco pulls it back and there's the equalising goal. Marisa with the finish. Well, they've certainly got better and better as the half's gone on. And just a couple of minutes before half time, the MK Dons are back level. They don't keep too many clean sheets for us, Green Rovers. And this one's eluded them as well. In the narrowest of angles, Marisa. Scores his fifth goal of the season in all competitions. Casey back to Durham. Towards his long over the halfway line. Cadron's winning it back. Chance on to get forward to Hoy. To the channel again, Maurice. Wasn't far away at all. Really good delivery into the box. 
Neil Grigg nearly on the end of it. Good play this from Lecco. Looks just unable to fire the second. Goalkeeper coming. Down up from the back here, MK Glass. Ball forward, headed away by Robson. It's a good run. This is Maraisa. Oh, that's a brilliant goal. His second of the afternoon. And from behind, they nail leads. Opened up his body and just. Puts it into the corner past Ross Doohan. He's got a really good pedigree in front of goal. Proved that of Peter Murray, proved it at Cheltenham. And he's proved it again this afternoon. That's a striker's goal. OK, Dons are ahead. And once again, Forrest Green are chasing the game. And do forward. OK, Dons head. Attack once more down the left hand side. This could be three. This one's past the post. It's a let off from Forest Green. Again, they're getting behind MK Dons. Since Forest Green took the lead in the first half, it's been all MK Dons. Jamie Cummett. And ball forward. Headed away again by Robson. Screen down the right hand side, they're making some good progress. And across, was there a foul there? Referee played a good advantage. The assistant referee did put his flag up. Pitt Harris tees it up, low shot. That's a really good save by Cummick. And he turned away. Felt there was an infringement there somewhere, one or two of the MK Don's defenders. And referee is turning the blind eye uh, blind into the black house. Coming in from Hendrick. Good save. And the goalkeeper on loan from Chelsea. Morgan Hendrick. He's had a good impact since he's come on. That's a substitute. That's a cross. Cross does come in. He's underneath it. And into the roof of the net. A chance for Godwin Malif. It's chipped into the box. Just over the top. Just three wins from 19 league matches before today. That's why they're bottom. Strong defending. And what a free kick, MK Dons. Coming though, still got to hang on. Robson pulled back, it's pulled wide, disappointing from Brandon Cooper. And he looks quite promising until he got the shot come cross in, which went behind. Just descending. It's been a gloomy season so far for Forest Green Rovers. Staring down the barrel of another league defeat here. And there goes that final whistle. Coming from behind, the MK Dons have taken all three points. Two very well taken goals from Mo Issa. And have won them all three points. They climb out of the bottom three, leaving behind Forest Green Rovers, who are still deep in trouble at the bottom of the League One table. The final score here in Gloucestershire to the delight of those MK Dons fans. Forest Green, Rovers 1, MK Dons 2.